Today's morning devotional. A prescription for healing of all ills. A sound mind in a sound body. Come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Matthew chapter 11 verse 28. God's healing power runs all through nature. If a tree is cut, if a human being is wounded or breaks a bone, nature begins at once to repair the injury. Even before the need exists, the healing agencies are in readiness, and as soon as a part is wounded, every energy is bent to the work of restoration. So it is in the spiritual realm. Before sin created the need, God had provided the remedy. Every soul that yields to temptation is wounded, bruised, by the adversary, but wherever there is sin, there is the Savior. When the gospel is received in its purity and power, it is a cure for the maladies that originated in sin. The Son of Righteousness arises, with healing in his wings. The love which Christ diffuses through the whole being is a vitalizing power. Every vital part the brain, the heart, the nerves it touches with healing. By it the highest energies of the being are roused to activity. It frees the soul from the guilt and sorrow, the anxiety and care, that crush the life forces. With it comes serenity and composure. It implants in the soul joy that nothing earthly can destroy joy in the Holy Spirit health-giving, life-giving joy. Our Savior's words, Come unto me, and I will give you rest, are a prescription for the healing of physical, mental, and spiritual ills. Though men have brought suffering upon themselves by their own wrongdoing he regards them with pity. In him they may find help. He will do great things for those who trust in him. If human beings would open the windows of the soul heavenward, in appreciation of the divine gifts, a flood of healing virtue would flow in.